Every incorrect choice we make, every sin we commit, is a violation of eternal law. That violation brings negative results we generally soon recognize. There are also other consequences of our acts of which we may not be conscious. They are nonetheless real. They can have a tremendous effect on the quality of our life here and most certainly will most powerfully affect it hereafter. Full repentance is absolutely essential for the atonement to work its complete miracle in your life. By understanding the atonement, you'll see that God is not a jealous being who delights in persecuting those who misstep. He's an absolutely perfect, compassionate, understanding, patient, and forgiving Father. He's willing to entreat, counsel, strengthen, lift, and fortify. Do not take comfort in the fact that your transgressions are not known by others. That's like an ostrich with his head buried in the sand. He sees only darkness and feels comfortably hidden. In reality, he is ridiculously conspicuous. Likewise, our every act is seen by our Father in heaven and his beloved Son. They know everything about us. Adultery, fornication, committing homosexual acts, and other deviations approaching these in gravity are not acceptable alternate lifestyles. They are serious sins. Committing physical and sexual abuse are major sins. Such grave sins require deep repentance to be forgiven. If you have seriously transgressed, you will not find any lasting satisfaction or comfort in what you have done. Excusing transgression with a cover-up may appear to fix the problem, but it does not. The tempter is intent on making public your most embarrassing acts at the most harmful time. Sometimes the steps of repentance are initially difficult and painful, like the cleansing of a soiled garment, yet they produce purity, peace of mind self-respect, hope, and finally a new person with a renewed life and abundance of opportunity. For your peace now and for everlasting happiness, please repent. Open your heart to the Lord and ask Him to help you. You will in the blessings of forgiveness, peace, and the knowledge you have been purified and made whole. Find the courage to ask the Lord for strength to repent now. I solemnly witness that Jesus Christ is the Redeemer. I know that He lives. I testify that He loves you personally and will help you. Obtain His forgiveness by repenting now. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.